answer with everything we've got. 525, now WBBM Bloomberg Business News. Good morning, Gina Cervetti. Good morning, Pat and Felicia. Looks like we could see a higher open this morning from the CME in Chicago. S&P futures up 8 points. NASDAQ E-mini futures up 13 and a half. And Dow E-mini's up 56, all healthy gains. NYMEX crude oil has turned things around from yesterday, up now 1.1%, trading at just over $53 a barrel after sliding more than 7% yesterday. At the Chicago Board of Trade this morning, corn is down three and a half, wheat down seven and three quarters cents, and soybeans are down five and three quarters. European markets are slightly lower this morning as Greek Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras heads to Brussels in a last-ditch attempt to secure a rescue. The leaders of Europe must decide if they can negotiate with Tsipras or prepare for the first ever departure from the euro currency. Chinese stocks lower again today. The Shanghai Composite sank for the fourth time in five days. A flurry of measures to stabilize the market is failing to stop the route that has erased more than 3.2 trillion of value in less than a month. Lower Wall Street closed yesterday as energy shares tumbled with oil. The Dow fell 46 and a half points, closing at almost 17,684. The Bloomberg WB, WBBM Chicago index slipped about three tenths of one percent. Sears Holdings was among the worst performers in that index yesterday. United Continental among the best. With business at 25 and 55, and in the noon business hour, live from the Bloomberg Newsroom, I'm Gina Cervetti, News Radio 780 and 105.9 FM. W